Hi, Nikki's up. Like all parents, Shelly Fradiani worries about whether Nikki and Philip will grow up healthy, but Shelly has reason for concern. Her awkward walk is the result of myotonic muscular dystrophy, a genetic disease that often shows no symptoms until adulthood. She was only diagnosed a few weeks ago. I was not able to get up on my toes anymore. I was having trouble opening jars and lifting things that I normally had no problem with before. The recent isolation of the gene that causes myotonic dystrophy offers hope to patients like Shelley. The immediate benefit is accurate diagnosis. And in this case, uh, not only is the uh, diagnosis extremely accurate, but the technology enables us to do quite simple tests to be very precise in determining who is at risk and who is not at risk for the disease. Pull hard, keep them up, hard as you can. The symptoms of myotonic dystrophy become more severe from generation to generation. Shelley doesn't know yet how much weaker her muscles will become or whether she has passed the gene to her children. But the discovery of the myotonic gene should soon lead to long-awaited treatments. The rational strategies for developing therapy would be one, uh, to develop drugs that might influence enzymes and therefore influence the severity of the disease. No auto horns toot, no foot whistles hoot. No Within my children's lifetime, I hope that, that they will be able to find some type of medication that, or some type of treatment that can help them. Doctors are hopeful that gene replacement therapy will be feasible with myotonic dystrophy. That would mean reprogramming the defective gene and eliminating the threat of this illness for Shelley's children. From Baylor College of Medicine in Houston, I'm Dr. Karen Johnson. I'm all banged up. I don't like it a lot.